All right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single lady. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? My name is Jovene. Jovene, how old are you? 28. 28, and what do you do? I am a assistant community manager, and I'm also working to get my real estate license right now. Okay, all right, and now what are some things you like to do for fun? I like to gather my friends and family together. I like to... Um, honestly, I like to turn on my music and okay. pour some wine and cook, um, just hang out at home nice. with my dog and just, sometimes I like to go out, but it just depends on like where we're going, but yeah. All right. And now what are some things you look for in a man? I look for an honest man, a man that has a lot of patience. Mm -hmm. Um, one that is, you know, emotionally stable as well. Mm -hmm. Um, someone that is on a path to spirituality mm -hmm. with the most high. So I look for that. Okay, got it. And now, what are some of your red flags? Like that you... Um, infidelity is, is a red flag. Mm -hmm. Infidelity. Um, any domestic type of situation. So if you're not able to handle a conversation or have a mature conversation, I just don't do loud conversations at all. Mm -hmm. um, that also has to tie in with the emotional maturity as well. So those are like my main red flags. Also, someone who's not able to set a boundary for themselves and also respect boundaries as well so okay. all right cool yeah. <laughs> so as you see here we have no pop balloons okay. so what that means i'm gonna go ahead and switch it on over to you okay. so for the first round i am gonna have you pop this look good how many balloons should we do let's do two balloons okay i'm gonna have you pop two balloons just based off of you know who doesn't really fall into your type or whatever it may be so let me hand you this and you can just go ahead and pop those two and i'll ask you why you ended up popping dang okay uh. oh okay. <laughs> okay and one more and... all right we can stay down here okay. all right let's start with your name and age so, i'm justin 34 okay. and justin why did you have your balloon unpopped well she's very well spoken she seems like a lady who knows what she wants um, you know, I'm approaching 35. I feel like I've done what I need to do as a young man and I'm stepping into the next level. She seemed like she was up there at the next level. Other than that, Shit, man. that's the only reason why I kept it unpopped. Okay, got it. So why did we end up popping his balloon? It is just the height. Um, Missing out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm um, Fuck with the shoes. Me, I would say, um, or just my, my physical type. For sure. Yes. Yeah. Okay. But you are very handsome. You're well dressed, though. I like. I love the uh, shades. I appreciate it. Yes. Yeah. I'm like the guy that you would call on the weekend. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. What the fuck? Let's go back over here. Your name is. Nigga taking Paul. side nigga applications. And Paul, why did you have your balloon unpopped? Um, just it's well put together. I kind of saw the height thing coming. I'm five ten, but just with heels, I'm not really cutting it. I guess. Okay. So he. He thinks height is the reason why. Is that why? He's not Honestly, a to be honest, I had to pop a balloon. Honestly, okay. I, I think it's swole. I didn't even notice that at first. So I just had to pop a balloon. Okay. So <laughs> to get my ass in the gym. I, I would definitely give it a try. You know, I'm I'm not necessarily always about physical, but I had to pop a balloon. So it's all good. Yeah. Okay. Respect. All right. Thank well, you. Nice hand on this All right. <laughs> I'm gonna have you ask these guys a question just to help you narrow it down. Um. Okay. How would you say that you tend to deal with conflict? Um, anytime that there's an issue, are you the type to walk away? Do you need a moment? Do you have to talk right then and there? What would you say, like, how do you, how do you tend to deal with conflict? Okay. Your name and age and the answer to your question. So my name is Josh, I'm 39. Um, how I deal with conflict is basically, I'm slow to, uh, res uh, to respond, so um, matter of fact, I'm sorry, react. So I'd rather respond, right? So um, that's just how I deal with it. Okay. Um, Good. Yeah. Well, okay. You want to add more? <laughs> um, what about you? How do you, you know? I like to take time also because I, I know myself. I know that I'm working on myself as well. So um, I definitely am the type of person who likes to take some time because I know we're going to come back. I'm the type of person that will always come back and talk about it. So. But yeah, if you could just respect what I'm trying to grow into, you know, as long as my person is there where I'm trying to grow and behavior traits that I'm trying to unlearn, that's exactly what I need. Okay. So if I needed some some time to gather my thoughts, are you the type to kind of like, you know, you need you need the answers now? Or are you going to give me if I say I need 
um, you know, some space. Is that okay? Yeah, absolutely. If you're able to communicate, I need space because I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to let you know I need some space. I'm not just going to not talk or not say anything. But as long as you're able to let me know, okay, cool. I know we're still good. We can, it's, it's we're, we're okay. Okay. So. Okay. All right, let's go to our next person here. Your name and age and the answer to your question. All right, uh, my name is Bassey. I'm 36. Um, I do what I deal with conflict. Yeah. So mostly what I usually do is, um, I don't usually get mad. I'm more like a, a fun, but I like to joke around a lot. So even it's very hard for me to get mad. So if I if I if I did get mad or whatever, what I usually do for the most part is I just take a, a space, a little break, um, then uh, think about the old thing. Why is it? I mean, why was the reason why we're mad about? So and, and I'll talk to you about it, and, I, and I'll be like, you know what? Um, what did I do wrong? And you just let me know, and I'll move on from there. Okay. Yeah. Thanks. Mm -hmm. All right. Our next guy, your name and age, and how do you deal with conflict? Uh, my name is Kenneth. Um, my age is 35. Uh, conflict, uh, if it goes hand in hand with like a disagreement, um, I would say um, disagreements should be handled. Like, you know, it, you know, it sh shouldn't be escalated if two people care about each other right. and the relationship is important. It shouldn't go that far, right. you know. So if they value the relationship, it should be talked about. So it'd be de-escalated de de real quickly. Absolutely. So that's what I think. Okay, good. Okay. Name and age, and how do you handle conflict? My name John Johnny, age thirty-four. Um, I'm growing. I used to break stuff, but I um, you know, as I get older, I learn that domestic you know, violence. The best thing to do if you can't handle or compose yourself, it's to just kind of walk away until you kind of like, you know, can regain and, you know, be in a mature space that you can talk about the situation. But like, um, I'm, I'm still in the process of growing, but um, I think uh, just walking away from the situation and then just being like, we can talk about it later. Um, because right now I'm just at the agitated state. As you say, the state. Yeah. So just like, you know, just knowing yourself, and you know thank you all right our next guy your name and age and how do you handle conflict my name is george i'm 35. i had a conflict by first taking my time um i don't like to overreact because you know overreaction is the, is the worst reaction in my book but um i i like to take my time take my um come back give me about like a day or so to come back in there that we can resolve. Damn, nigga. Like, oh, 24 hours? You always need a day? Like, that's your not, time frame? It, no. Okay. No, it not can at all. take a it day. It can. Okay. It, at, the, at the most. But you're able to communicate. I'm very right? communicative. You're not silent. I'm very com person, no, okay. not at all. I'm very communicative. I ain't gonna say but at the day at the most. But I'm very communicative. Okay. I'm very, very communicative. Okay. All right, nigga, now. Thank you. Okay. Time to pop some balloons. Communicate your ass into a pause. <laughs> I am going to have you pop two balloons. Jeez. I know, I know. Based off of what you heard, whatever it may be, go ahead and pop those two. Uh. Gotta do it. Okay. Okay, um, one more. She looked good. Let's start right on over here. Why did we end up popping his? It's really hard. I had to pop my balloon. Um, mm -hmm. Honestly, if I had to say it would just be our, I, I don't want to say it's a physical connection. I just, we're only going off of a few questions right now. So I have to play the game and pop a balloon. Mm -hmm. So yes, I'm sorry. Yeah. And so why did you have your balloon unpopped? Uh, just curiosity to get to know the person. Okay. Yeah. But is she someone that's your type? Um, I would say yes. Okay. Yeah. What makes for your type? Um, I love uh, originality, you know, original hair, you know, just, just everything. It's not, it's just her, you know what I'm saying? Put together. Okay. Thank yeah. You. Perfect. And let's go to our next guy here. Why do you end up popping his balloon? Okay. I do have a reason why I popped your balloon. And it was because you say that you have a history of domestic violence and that is, it's not okay. For me. It's so not okay. Just, my guy. I had to pop your balloon for that reason. I understand. I mean, I just was being honest and I, yeah. you know, did state that I'm working on it and Absolutely. that, you know, I'm, I have different uh, methods of dealing with situations, but it wasn't like physical with a woman. It's just like I, I said, break General. things, yeah. but that's still, you know, yeah. in that range, but uh, domestic violence. Every day. 
you're very beautiful and you, you just definitely give off good vibes and got direction and know where you're going and I definitely someone I would be attracted to thank you talk to but okay. thank you for your time yeah thank you okay so we do have three balloons left go ahead and ask these guys another question um what would you say what have you guys have identified about yourself any characteristics that you would say has made it challenging for you guys to have a successful relationship um i a toxic trait mm. okay let's start down there why don't we start with him let's give him some time <laughs> All right, the answer to her question. My toxic trick is I tend to move fast. Um, I wear my heart on my sleeve. Um, I'm working on it, though. I'm working on, on being patient and taking my time. Okay. Yeah. I appreciate that honesty. Yeah. The answer to her question. Sorry, can you ask that question again? Because it seems like it was in two and one. What characteristic question. traits about yourself that okay. you've identified and noticed okay. that you can say be a toxic trait to your relationship? Mm, well, for me, um, I joke around a lot in, in my relationship. I, I mean, I'm very, I'm good at that. Sometimes that could be like a defense mechanism for me. So I think oh. that might be like a little... But I do know when to be serious though, so yeah. Okay. So yeah, I'm just very like, I'm not really like a um, confidential kind of a person, especially to, to us female, and I'm not. Yeah. So it can come off as like dismissive or no, 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 no. No, no, I just joke around a lot. Like, it's having me on, it's having me having a conversation about, let's talk about a sport now. I'm the one that might tease you over that, so yeah, it, I'm, oh, not, okay. I'm, not, I'm, I'm that kind of a person. I get so, yeah. you. I don't get him. Okay, thank you. Yeah. I have no clue all what right, he's talking about. Step? Don't know what he yes, means at all. Uh, my name? So, oh, just, yeah, okay. you can say your name again, but the answer to the question. <laughs> so, my name is Josh. I believe a toxic trait that I have, um, possibly having, just having some difficulty opening up. Um, so that's like something I struggle with. So I want to know more about you, but um, I've noticed that, you know, people said that I have difficulty opening up. So, okay. Um, yeah. Okay, thank you. All right. You know what time it is. Time uh, to pop. Okay. How many? One. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna. Okay. All right. So why do we end up popping his balloon? Not that it would ever be an issue, but there, I'm, I'm a Pisces, so my entire life revolves around emotions. So sometimes it may be taking the long way if you're playing and I'm really serious. It may come off. Um, as a misunderstanding and, and of course in that heat of the moment sometimes it can be a little bit difficult to understand that person where you're coming from and mainly more so it's just it, it's just going to be the the whole joking matter i guess and i had to pop a balloon so oh, yeah, that's, <laughs> that's fun yeah thank you very much and so why did you have your balloon unpopped for her um i was just curious trying to see on what she's all about and you do look good by the way so yeah um mm -hmm. i like her, her energy her flow very calm so, yeah. <laughs> this new, yeah. i like her <laughs> <laughs> What the questions fuck? for her. We got one down here. <laughs> what is three characteristics that people people will say about you um, that that stands out? I'm sorry, that didn't sound right. <laughs> no, I understand what you okay, meant. Thank you. Um, I'm very personable. That's okay. one characteristic. With that, I'm I'm a goofball. Mm -hmm. I, I like to play with. Don't hear that. Um, <laughs> and I would say I'm crazy. Very thoughtful. That's also another characteristic that that's crazy. Me. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool. Good. I'm good. Okay. <laughs> All right. You had some time to think. What's your question? Um, okay. Question. Um, so, sexuality is a very big thing for me. Um, exploration. Are you into that? Is that too much of a forward question right now? Um, what do you mean by that? I'm going to need a little bit more detail. Okay. I mean, just being, getting to a place where you're more vulnerable. Um, and I guess... I'm open to that. You're open to that? Yes. Okay. Um, all right. Um, what the fuck are they talking about? <laughs> okay. All right. You so, did? Yeah, you I'm did. <laughs> Okay. All right. <laughs> I don't even know. All right. So, all right. Shit. It is time to pop a balloon. Okay. Oh, so go for it. So, uh, the gym is a very big, big important um, aspect, right, of my life. Um, so, what is your concept like? How do you, what do you think about the gym? 
constant improvement. What are your What are your thoughts on that? Are you into the gym? I work out. I work out. I like to hike. I'm a very active person. So, um, yeah, I go to the gym. Okay. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Time to pop a balloon. Okay. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> All right, so what do you end up popping his? Um, I love everything about you. I love that you wear your heart on a sleeve because mm -hmm. I honestly, I do as well. Mm -hmm. um, I love that you're thoughtful. You take your time with conflict and confrontation. I just feel like as far as a match wise, um, I just wasn't feeling that initial connection. I'm so sorry. I understand. I'm so I sorry. Respect, respect, okay. respect. Perfect. Let's head on back. Uh, <laughs> All right, let me bring you on up here. Bring you on up here. So... I know you, you you thought hard for those questions. So I don't know if you have any final questions, but any final questions between either one of you? Um, I don't have any final questions. No. Yeah, okay, so is it a yes for you for her? It's definitely yes. Ah, is it a yes for you for him? It's a yes. We got a match! Okay. <laughs> I'll take this and you guys can go on off. <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and check out our next single lady. Hello, welcome in. What's your name? My name's Kendra. Kendra, how old are you? I'm 20. Hey man, say man. Uh, this has been Pop the Balloon or Find Love, episode 16. Let us know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Let me know if y'all think uh, y'all would have found love. Let me know if they was tripping. Till next time, peace. Just finished. Bow.